Hello guys, today I'm gonna explain to you how you can set up the onboarding feature on your Discord server. So first things first, I'm gonna create my own Discord server that I'm gonna explain in. As you see, I just created this one fast. I mean, it's easy steps, so I don't even have to explain them. Next, I'm actually going to server settings. And then go down to enable community. And then click on get started. Check these two. Next. And then next and then check this one and then finish setup save changes and as you can see the onboarding tab just appeared for me okay i'm sorry this is um this is a problem okay as you can see the onboarding feature just appeared for me and click on check it out as you can see it's going to explain to you things just click on next and got it and skip and got it and next okay oh got it skip now you actually have seven total channels and five channels new members can talk in and you actually need to create channels and roles so let's go and do that i'm gonna begin with the channels let's go okay as you can see i just made seven channels here that members can talk or speak in and now i'm gonna go back to server settings and then go to roles and I'm gonna create some roles. And now I'm gonna add the language, select your language onboarding feature. So I'm gonna add actually three language. Okay guys, so I created some channels and some roles and now I'm gonna actually set up the onboarding tab so come back to onboarding and then here you're gonna click on setup and then as you can see you're going to select the channels that the members can see like default channels so I'm gonna select them okay so uh, it seems like I made only five and it needs to be seven so I will go back and add two more Okay, so as you can see, I'm gonna select the new channels I just made and seven channels are done. Now next, I'm going to make my first question, which is select your games. And here the first answer will be League of Legends. And the channels is going to be, for example, if you've already created a channel for League of Legends players, you're gonna select it. My game, so I'm gonna select games, okay? And then roles, I'm gonna select law, League of Legends. And then the emoji, you can actually select any emoji you want, but if you've already uploaded an emoji that refers to League of Legends, you can just select it by searching for it and then selecting it here. But in my case, I'm just gonna select, um, for example, this, okay, this. Now I'm going to add Minecraft and the same thing, you're going to select the channel of Minecraft if you've already created one. If you didn't, uh, just select one channel or you can just make it for roles without channels and I'm going to select Minecraft and give it emoji, for example, a cube and yeah, save. And here I'm going to go for Valorant. Well guys, I think if I uploaded emojis, it will look better. but since I didn't, I will just pick random emojis for now. But remember, you can select your own emojis. And then add a question. And the second question is going to be, what do you speak? Or what's your language? All right. And here I'm going to select English. And I'm going to select here the English channels. In my case, I didn't select any. I didn't make any. So I'm just going to select randomly. And then here I'm going to select English. And I'm going to... For example, pick an emoji for the US flag, United States. And then French, same thing. I'm going to select here French and then select the channels for French. For example, this and this. Then give the French role and pick the emoji for France. France, French flag. Okay, save. And then the last one is Arabic. And I'm going to select the Saudi Arabia emoji and... Just for example, these two roles or oh, these two channels and the Arabic role and save. Click on next. And here, this step, you can skip it. It's not that important. 
and yeah click on enable onboarding and as you can see if you want to preview the onboarding to see it just click on preview okay as you can see it will ask for you to select your game as, as I said it's better to upload your custom emojis or the custom icons for the roles as you can see League of Legends Minecraft and next and then what's your language for example I speak Arabic English and French so you will be added to the chat CMD and one other you will also receive the receive the English and French and Arabic role click on finish and yeah actually if you don't want people to select multiple choices you just come to questions click on edit and then a low multiple answers you just can't make it like this if you don't want people to be able to skip this option or this question click on required and same for this one so if you do required for that one and save it if we preview again I can't skip the first question anyways guys this was the video I hope you like this video if you have any question regarding this subject please type in in comments and I will see you in the next one until then Please guys, please guys don't forget to like and subscribe. Goodbye.